Howdy! I just wanted to hop on here today and share some of my favorite photos from my trip out west to San Diego in November. For the most part, all of the photos I'm going to share are on film. There are a couple on digital. I will note the betrayals when they occur. The cameras I took with me were my Fuji GA645 Pro, my Fuji Class S, and my very new camera, my Fuji GSW693. And my digital camera is a Canon 6D Mark II, and I use a Tamron G2 24-70 lens on it. Uh, love that lens. Can't show that camera because I'm using it. Anyway, let's get into it. Uh, pretty much our first full day in San Diego was spent in Balboa Park. Uh, Balboa Park is a 1200 acre park in San Diego. It has got rose gardens, cactus gardens, a botanical garden, koi ponds, Japanese garden. Um, it's got museums, beautiful architecture all over the place. Uh, it, lots of open spaces, fountains, museums, and the San Diego Zoo. It's an absolutely beautiful place, and I cannot recommend it enough if you're in the area. We hung out in Ocean Beach a pretty fair amount over the course of the trip. We walked down the pier, walked around the neighborhood, and spent one magnificent morning walking along Dog Beach. Um, easily the most blessed place I've ever been in my life. We popped over to Coronado Island uh, for a little bit one day. Felt a little too fancy for me, but I did get a couple photos there I really like. We went over to the La Jolla neighborhood one day and saw the sea lions and the seals. And I have to tell you, real highlight of the trip for me, turns out seals are just wet dogs and they're perfect. And here are just a few other photos from, you know, various places in San Diego during my time there with my friends.
we did leave the city for a few days. We went to uh, out to Joshua Tree and over to LA. Um, and I want to share some photos from my time in LA. Uh, we just hit up some really big spots. We went to Hollywood Boulevard, Santa Monica Pier, Venice Beach, and the Venice Canals. Santa Monica Pier was busy as hell. Um, I love tourist stuff and I loved seeing the super crowded pier and all the people being out and about and, you know, saw some people recording TikToks, uh, maybe or something. Um, yeah, you know, all sorts of street vendors and roller coasters. Um, really lovely. Uh, I saw this guy playing music. I didn't take a picture. But wow. I really liked his music. <laughs> Most of these photos, um, generally in LA, were taken my Fuji Class S, which I am a massive fan of. I love this camera. Um, I've been using it for about six months now. It's um, the only point and shoot I really use. Uh, it's so reliable, um, and I just really appreciated being able to trust this little camera, um, you know, and have its pocket ability while I was traveling. And I feel really good about the photos I took with it on this trip. We did also spend some time at Torrey Pines, which is an incredibly beautiful uh, state preserve up north of San Diego. I have more photos from Torrey Pines that I already shared in my video. Um, I just did about my Fuji GSW 693. I shared the first two rolls I used through that camera and both rolls were on this trip. Um, I will link it if you are interested in seeing more photos from Tory Pines or also just generally um, more photos from the Fuji GSW 693. Anyway, uh, I have uh, just one more video I wanna make about this trip. I just wanna share the photos I took out of Joshua Tree and talk about that a little bit. Um, but I didn't want to burden this video or make it really long. I figured it'd be nicer to just make a couple of short videos. But generally, I want to tell you, I'm really interested in people's travel setups for film. I feel like I took one camera too many for riding on a plane, walking around all day. But I was really happy with all the photos I got back. So maybe it was worth it? <laughs> if you've got a dedicated travel setup, I would love to hear about it. Oh, and, um... This is my fifth video, and I have to say, people have been so nice. Uh, I really, really appreciate talking to people here and um, hearing others' experiences with you know these cameras or situations, and just generally really appreciate the response I've gotten generally from people. Um, so I just wanted to say thank you. Thank you for being so kind while I make uh, my silly little videos. And I hope this new year is treating you right. Bye.